Posterior total hip replacement precautions should strictly be followed for three months after surgery. You should check with your physician before foregoing them. There are three precautions. Number one, the hip joint angle should never be bent past 90 degrees. Note the angle here which is past 90 degrees, so this position should be avoided. This is a 90 degree angle and anything less should be avoided. Bending forward at your waist while sitting can also make the angle go past 90 degrees. Lying on your back is safe. Even bending your hip a little is okay. Now here is past 90 degrees so this is wrong. Again, here is a 90 degree angle with anything less should be avoided. This is a safe position. This is not a safe position. Bending past 90 degrees risks dislocating your hip. Sitting in a high chair can help keep you in a safe position. Keeping your knee lower than your hip means your joint is greater than 90 degrees and you are in a safe position. Now the knee is higher than the hip, so your joint is past 90 degrees and you are not in a safe position. This incorrect position can occur if you sit in a short chair as shown here and so should be avoided. The second hip precaution is the hip joint angle should never cross the midline. The best way to avoid this is to never cross the legs. Use pillows to raise your chair height and always use a chair with an armrest. To stand, place your involved foot out, scoot to the edge of the chair, and push up using the armrest. Again, avoid a hip joint angle past 90 degrees. To sit, simply reverse the process. This is incorrect. He did not place his involved foot out nor scoot to the edge of the chair. Now his hip angle is past 90 degrees. The third and final precaution is to avoid internal rotation of the hip. This inward rotation is often mistakenly done during sit to stand transition. It can also be mistakenly done while lying down. A simple way to remember is to not turn your toes in. Placing a pillow between your knees can help you to avoid this. While walking, the safest way to turn is to turn away from the involved hip. You may turn towards the involved hip, but must pick your foot up to avoid pivoting. A simple way to avoid pivoting is to pick the foot up, then turn the body. This is pivoting and has broken the third hip precaution of avoiding internal rotation of the hip. So we can continue to make these free educational videos. Please subscribe to our channel.